Hey everyone, welcome back to Shade Review. In today's video, we are reviewing the Ray-Ban Powderhorn Sunglasses. So the model number here is the RB3457. And let's go ahead and pop these sunglasses on face and talk about the dimensions. These sunglasses have 58 millimeter lenses and a 17 millimeter bridge. And I absolutely love the style of these sunglasses. They look really, really good on face with their really cool and retro double bridge aviator uh, sunglasses style. These sunglasses definitely scream 1970s, you know, alpine skiing or snowboarding, you know, that type of uh, feel to them. And they also make some really other cool colorways that come in white and red that definitely, again, remind me of that 1970s snowboarding skiing scene. These sunglass frames are made out of a nylon material, so they're going to be extremely lightweight. And also the lenses are made out of a polymer material, so they're also going to be very lightweight. However, unlike glass, they're going to scratch a lot easier being made out of Palmer. Now, just like on every pair of authentic Ray-Ban sunglasses, we can see a little painted on Ray-Ban logo here in the top right corner of the lens. And then here in the middle left of the lens, we can see an etched RB logo there for authentication purposes. Now, as far as other logos go, these sunglasses have raised Ray-Ban logos here in the top corners of the sunglasses. Again, that's going to add for kind of styling and also authentication purposes of the frame. And honestly, I don't mind the Ray-Ban logos here too much. They definitely are relatively discreet and they aren't too loud at all. They're definitely less loud than the painted on Ray-Ban logo there. Now these frames are made in Italy and they say here in the inner right temple of the frames, they just say Ray-Ban made in Italy. And they also have an all metal hinge, which is a five barrel all metal hinge, which feels really, really good when you open up and when closing the sunglasses. It just feels very good and substantial, which is also really nice and makes sunglasses feel very premium. Now, of course, having these nylon frames, they're not going to feel quite as premium as something with acetate, but they're gonna be dramatically uh, more lightweight than something with acetate frames, especially considering how big this pair of sunglasses is. If they were made out of all acetate, they'd be very, very heavy. So this is a really nice and more sporty pair uh, because they are made out of nylon, which is also really nice. As far as coverage from the sun goes, these are going to offer very good coverage from the sun. So here up top, we can see there isn't a huge gap so that lets sunlight in unprotected. And then here on the sides, I would say there's a pretty average gap that lets sunlight in unprotected. Definitely not too big. Now, as far as pricing goes on these, these are going to run you around $161 directly from Ray-Ban's website and in most stores. However, I'm going to leave a link description down below to Amazon where you guys can pick these sunglasses up for a much cheaper there. Overall, I really do like these sunglasses. I think Ray-Ban just absolutely knocked it out of the park of the styling of these frames. They just look really, really good on face. Honestly, this might be one of my favorite Ray-Ban frames of 2022. Of course, the year just started, but these just look so, so good. And I'm definitely glad that I just bought a pair for this video. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, make sure to give me a big thumbs up down below. And of course, make sure to subscribe button and then you'll be notified every single time I put a brand new video just like this one to my YouTube channel. Again, thank you all so much for watching and I'll catch you all in the next one.